Our 2013 CES coverage is powered by Ford. Go further. Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, and here we are at the Intel booth at CES 2013. I am in front of the Perceptual Computing demo area, which is actually showing off a new SDK from Intel. So this is a platform targeted at developers. If you take a look at the SDK itself, it's free for download, but then it has this creative camera here on top. So the way that it works is I'm actually going to, if you back up just a bit, Mallory, so that the camera's not detecting you, right? So my hand will go straight at the, at the camera, and then I can actually turn it over. And then you can see that I have each of my fingers are being recognized. And pull it back out, pull it in, turn it around, bounce the coins around, try to catch them. All of this really cool stuff. So the SDK actually deals with the entire laptop. So it's going to be dealing with voice, it's going to be dealing with the camera, it's going to be dealing with the gyroscope, it's going to be dealing with a whole bunch of different things. So it's not just about this camera, it's about a whole slew of other things. And actually, why don't we take a break from our sponsor, and then I'm going to get into a video series that we're going to be launching around this SDK in just a few weeks. Sync AppLink puts you in command of some of your favorite apps while on the go. Sync AppLink allows you to stay in the know with NPR's award-winning news app, navigate songs and stations on Pandora, access Slacker Radio's huge list of stations, or even keep up with your favorite baseball team via the MLB at bat app. Better yet, you can launch and control all of these apps with simple voice commands. Sync AppLink is just another example of Ford's commitment to keeping you connected while on the go. Thanks again to Ford for powering Mobile Geek CES special. So here's one of my favorites from IDF. Now this is a Kung Pao Kevin. So it's reading my hands, you can see down here in the corner. And the quicker that I, you know, slap my hands up, the more points that I get. So this is just a fun little game that Intel's kind of come up to just show about how the, how the camera works, what's going on. But what I'm going to be doing with my video series with the SDK, I'm going to actually be working with a developer. His name's Gareth Murphin. I'll put his uh, Google Plus in the description of the video below. And uh, we're going to be working on maybe developing a toolkit for on top of the Unity SDK. So we're going to try to like take this and then apply it to another SDK, which is crazy, right? So if you want to follow along, make sure that you you know follow us on Google Plus in the in the description below because this is kind of cool, right? Right? Nicole Scott here at Mobile Geeks. Thanks to Ford.